Alright, what is going on, everyone? I have never played through Banjo-Kazooie, ever! And this will be my first actual playthrough. And I can see that it's already having problems on the screen. So, one second. How's everyone doing? I saw Fnatic out there. Joe, who said he couldn't make it. Oscar. It's not Mighty Bond Jack, but I will be playing that, I believe. Real quick. Let's see if that fixes it. Okay, that fixed it. Hey, what's going on, you man? One second, there's going to be one more pause of sound here, and the screen's going to freeze for a second. Am I on the moon today? What? What do you mean? What? What's wrong with my sound? Oh, yeah. Alright, so, yes, I've never played Banjo-Kazooie before last night. Last night I played a little bit to see how it was, and it's, uh, interesting. Okay. Use a left stick to select a game. So, the cool thing is, well, not the cool thing, but this is originally on Nintendo 64, and now I'm playing the re... I don't know, mastered version on Xbox 360. Um, they took all of the references in Nintendo out except for one. And it's that one right there. That's the only Nintendo-related thing you will see in this game. Alright. Time for the intro. Kind of a long intro, surprisingly, too. I never played DK64, either. So we'll let this, uh, this intro run. So, if the text and the sounds and anything like that sound familiar, it kind of should. Oh, man. Can't 
Getting a raid already. What's going on, Cory and Oka Stewie? Oh no, there's somebody prettier than this witch. <laughs> going on there, uh, oh, Fnatic was here, Crispy Plays, Jake, uh, Sabrosian, Natic, who definitely was both there, Zith, Boax, Liana, man. How's it going, everybody? Where is the man himself? By the way, I'm not going to narrate this because of the sounds it makes. I'm doing alright. And there's Banjo sleeping. Where is the man himself? I know he was there before. He was playing some Mario Maker. Quad, how's it going? There he is. Thank you for that, Corey. So, uh, how did the Mario Maker go after I left? By the way, make sure to check out Super Patuka Gaming. I saw him playing some Mario Maker earlier. I'm doing all right. Banjo, dang it, wake up. So, for those that don't know that are here right now, um, there are three out of the four members who are going to be part of the 20XX Seed Racers tomorrow. Myself, Corey from CC Gaming, and Nintendo Addict. We are all going to be doing the same seed in 20XX, so if you guys would like to participate and play along with us, uh, sub to me and check out my Twitter and all that, and you'll get to see when I start tomorrow. You have been outed. What's going on, Falcons Gaming? <laughs> Alright, so, I'm not going to go through the tutorials. I'm just going to come over here and talk to Bottles and be like, ah, uh, no, nah, I'm, I'm good. Bottles a short-sighted mole. Banjo and Kazooie. No, this is uh, straight from Xbox Live Arcade. <coughs> oh no, Gruntilda took her. This is actually part of Game Pass. This one and the second one, and Nuts and Bolts, but I'm not going to play Nuts and Bolts. I hear it's bad. Ah, oh, not viewer levels. Okay. Just be if you think you're already good enough. I'm good enough. Bet we're good enough, Bottle Brain. So, for those that don't know, uh... The game, Ukulele, is basically a spiritual successor to this. And the relationship between the two here of Banjo-Kazooie are just like Ukulele. I do believe some of the people actually worked on it. So... There's a lot of similarities. Um, okay, just like you said, you collect six honeycomb pieces, you get another full health bar. Or full health honeycomb thing. Hey. Come here. What did I have to do for this guy? Uh, 
you're not gonna do what I want you to do? Apparently not. All right, Corey. Good luck on the practice today. <laughs> Sorry, uh, Kajido. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Still not helping you, so go away. Okay, I know there's a button I'm missing. <laughs> I haven't played in a while either, so... Okay, so that gives me health. <coughs> I'm trying to remember what the heck the button is for this. Well, that doesn't help. Oh, I think it is... Nope. Crouch and B. No, it wasn't that. It's the... It's the... Butt stop. Crouch and V. Okay. There it is. Duh. I knew that. I never use this move. Right. Yeah. See, I didn't play... I only played one level or something yesterday, so I did learn that eventually. Okay. But I'm trying to go through here now to get the extra health... full health thing. Okay, so... On my Discord, I mentioned this game has one super, super obnoxious sound. And you're about to hear it in about less than a minute. This sound. Oh, I didn't get it. Hold on. I need to uh, actually use some air. This sound. Oh my god. In my ears, it is painful. And especially in places where you have to uh, swim. Yeah, you get to hear that more than once. And so, oh great, Nintendo 64 doesn't have that. Why did they add it to Xbox then? What the heck? I'm an extra life. You sure are. <laughs> exactly. Alright, what else am I missing here? Okay, over here. So basically this first area is just to get you acclimated to the controls. Basically when you go to each one of these sections, he teaches you a new move, and you're rewarded with one of these. Yay, there we go. But I didn't want to go through that tutorial, so I just wanted to do what I needed to to get it. So for those that don't know what this game is, Banjo Kazooie is basically a 3D ed exploration adventure type game. If you played ukulele, you know exactly what it what it's like. What's going on, Minion fan? I don't expect anybody to be ever at my streams, <laughs> but I love when people are here. I'm totally ready to. <laughs> I 
So they did, I apparently they fixed the camera a little bit, even though the camera has infuriated me when I was playing last night in a few parts. Oh yeah, she rhymes with everything she says. Well, thank you, Minion. Mungo. But you said you were pretty. Why would you want that? So there's one thing that kind of bothered me about the layout of this. It's a jiggy. Basically find these to open up new areas. So it's kind of like Mario 64 in that you find uh, you find pictures. The problem is they added an extra step and I'm not sure I like it. This first one isn't too much of a problem, but the other ones become more of a problem. Basically, you need a certain amount of jiggies to get into the uh, next area. Alright, let's go. Yay, I finished the picture. So, this is the problem I have with this. You complete the picture, but you don't go in the picture to start it. You have to then go find the entrance in this area, in her lair. So luckily this one's right here. It does actually, it reminds me of, a, of the Bowser one. But you would think maybe, hey, you completed the picture. Let's run into the picture. Nope. You have to go find the entrance to the area. And I think that's a really unneeded extra step. Alright, so basically... Okay, so I can learn three new moves in here. So, you, the attacks you have is a roll while you're moving, a punch when you're barely walking or not moving, you have the peck, and then you have this move that I never freaking use. You got a backflip. These are Jinjos. Mumbo's tokens. Those will be used later. Oh, this is very much after Mario 64. Get one of those for the explanation. So, notes are kind of like coins, but they're also kind of like stars from Mario 64. There's a hundred in each level, but then there's doors... Ah, wrong button. Um, there's doors that open only when you get a certain amount of music notes. Uh, before DK64? Okay. I'm gonna try to collect. Basically, it's a collectathon. Eh. But it's very precise with some stuff like this. Oh my god. Also, the camera does not like me. Oh my god. Yeah, they're kind of like red coins. I guess that's the best best way to think of them, but there's a hundred of them instead of eight from Mario and 20 or whatever from Yoshi. Oh my god, that sound. 
Oh, it hurts. Okay, we're not gonna mess with him right now. This thing will pop open and he'll tell you right now. Go away, leave my honey comes alone. Nope. These give back one health each, and they will stay there until I leave. So, I don't have to pick them up immediately. <laughs> yeah, you, you totally hit me with an orange. So, the nice thing about this game, unlike stars in Mario 64, when you collect Jiggies, you don't jump out of the level. It just says, alright, keep playing. Alright, so this guy... Trying to make him hit these. There we go. Ten of us in each world. <laughs> hey, Griefus, I knew you would enjoy this one. I'm pretty sure Yoshi Island DS has 20 also. So I can leave whatever I want, basically, as long as I just get back to the start pad. What do we got over here? Oh, we got a monkey. Chimpy want orange now. Feed Chimpy. Huh, this guy had oranges. Nope. Here, have an orange. Yeah, oranges are nice. Xbox. <clears throat> Fat bear. Banjo's not fat. I would say Banjo is the most fit bear I've seen in a game. Ancient ways of the egg. This move is disturbing when you think about it. So basically, you could shoot eggs out of your mouth, out of her mouth. So that's cool. But then you could poop them out instead. <laughs> oh God. Well, thank you for those fifty. I would love to play that game at some point. So this... I can't do it. I guess I gotta come back. I'll find him. Because I've never played either of them. And I decided to start here. Ah! Ah, no! Oh yes, this has a ton of collectibles. Though I guess it's not as bad as uh, Star Fox Adventures. Yay, I beat up the monkey. Alright, so I'm almost done with this part of this level. I need to go find the mole again to get another move. Okay, so you hit me, I'll take this. Did I miss one over here? Okay, no I didn't. I'm not gonna deal with that bull either right now. Jump in the air. Oh, here's what I need. Right or left trigger. Okay, so this is the... Basically, this is a butt stop. Okay. 
that. Oh, I didn't know about that. I didn't do that before when I played. I can see Banjo and Kazooie getting in as DLC because they're both their character that is liked on both systems. Oh, hi. And people from both consoles know them. Oh, there's a green one. Oh. So many things. It's actually the main reason why I didn't want to play ukulele either, because I never played these, so I never had any connection to them. Ew. That's awful. Um, oh, I'll get this one. I don't want to go in here quite yet. Oops. Yeah, but this version adds that annoying sound I was talking about on Discord. Alright, um... Before I go in there, I'm going to do some other stuff first. Hi right there. Trot. This is like the most important move I've gotten in the entire game. Hey, Mr. Fish, what's up? Talent Trot. Taking these. Oh, this is nothing like Duck Hunt and how they act. This is actually where they're friends. By, by the way, I'm changing something in the uh, stream, so one second. Um, lag? It should be lag. I hope not. I'm changing the. Uh, title and stuff. Oh, the no- you didn't hear- okay, I'll, t I'll do the noise in a minute. Let me change this real quick. Did I seriously get subs and it didn't give me the sound? Oh, well, thanks for the sub, Boax, by the way. And anybody else who subbed, I got two messages here and it didn't go through. Alright, so... Okay. <sighs> Title of the stream should be changed now. Okay, that goes over there. Alright, we're gonna go and visit this house. Oh, 
Yeah. You love a little best shaman in all game. <laughs> So I need one more token. I have an idea where that fifth one's at. Time is weird. So this makes this a lot easier. <laughs> Because you can just run up and down this hill. Because if you don't use uh, Kazooie, you slide. I guess it's not over here. Oh, I know where it's at, actually. I forgot. I'm an idiot. But I gotta do one thing over here. Uh, this is something I did before I got the next thing that I'm going for. Came over here and I went, Whee! <laughs> yeah, so you've memorized a few games. Alright, let's go. Run, 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 run. So basically all the levels in this are just giant, open levels. It's just go and explore and collect stuff. And At some point there's bosses. I'm coming, I'm coming, relax. Well, I mean, GTA, at least one and two were kind of open world, I'd say. I, I never played them a lot, but I would think they were kind of more open world, but maybe they're like this? Alright, so no, it wasn't there. I know where it's at. It's in here. Oh yeah, it has lots of collectibles. It's very much more open than Mario 64. Oh, but that's too slippery. Even for Kazooie. And the music changes basically how, based on where you're at in the level, if you can tell. Now you get the drums. But when I was by the ant, ant nest, it was doing military stuff. I'm an ant. Oh, termite. Sorry. Hey, Lance, what's up? So, this guy can walk on even uh, more steep surfaces than Kazooie can. But he has no attack. <laughs> hey, where'd you get those shorts? I want them. No, you can't have my shorts. Yay, found a whole hundred notes. Well, that's because it probably got deleted. But it's funny... 
when you are a termite, his shorts are backwards. Notice the belt is on the back. <laughs> A cool backpack or else. Ah, uh, no. I have never played them either. That is why we are doing it for the first time. All right, I got all ten. Nice. Wow. He takes no fall damage, really? I didn't know that. Uh, trust me, it was not me. Oh, he doesn't. Wow. Alright, so I'm missing one honeycomb. Where is this honeycomb? Is it in the water? I want to say it's in the water. Or is it with the bowl? Come here. Ow. I'm gonna go... Well, before I... I'm gonna use this for a reason... Oh, no. I gotta go over here, so I gotta change back. Aha! <coughs> hey, pretzel, what's up? I'm gonna have to re-enter the level anyway. <laughs> Gotta come over here first of all. You don't put spaces after your your periods, Lance. That's why it keeps bugging you about links. Put a space after your period, and it will not bug you anymore. All right, let's go become the termite again. Yes, exactly like that. See, Ogbot did not get mad at you. That's why he always gets mad at you, is because you don't put spaces after the periods, so he thinks it's a link. Yeah, it looks normal. <laughs> Alright. Another interesting thing about this game, you get the transformations within the levels. Hmm. Which is cool and all. Uh, I don't know how to do first person. I've been trying to figure it out and I didn't know. But you can also go outside of the levels with the transformations.
What? You were taught wrong. Well, going up just zooms it in more. I had to go back over here anyway. Oh, there it is. I know how to get that. You were, I'm sorry, but you were taught very wrong. So it's, it's literally right over here. Oops. It's right there. There we go. And I believe I am done in this level completely. Oh. Happy? Well, I'm shooting them in the mouth with the eggs and they disappear. What was I looking for? I was looking for totals. 110, 2. Nice. All right, let's get out of here. I don't have a GG command here, unfortunately, Pretzel. Oh yes, the mo monsters from the levels will come out. Alright, so that was the first level. Now I gotta go find the other levels. Eh, can't get up there without. That. They force you to get this. Jam jars. Yes, I did. Yeah, sucks today. Stan Lee died. It, it was gonna happen within the next couple years. He was, he was quite old and it was just gonna happen. Start with what? This? No, you don't start with this. You learn this in the first level. Not in Spiral Mountain. Brentilda. It's not rude, it's just true. He was 95. Everybody should have been waiting, you know, knowing it was going to happen. Moldy cheese flavored toothpaste. Engine oil. Saggy Maggie's Boutique. You can write him down for me, how about that? She ever said well we'll see if she ever says orange so yeah as i said before 
I don't like this part of the game. Where you finish a picture, but then you have to go find the level. The level's not right here. Like, it's... No, not even close to here. Hey there. Hey, member, what's going on? I activated a magic cauldron, a purple one. Find two of the same color to create a shortcut. Shock jump disc. Find me and I'll tell you how to use it. How do you think differently? You know, I never did go in here when I was playing before. Oh, okay. This was on Nintendo 64. That's a red one. Oh. <laughs> These camera angles, though. I played it for a couple hours last night just to see how it was and if I wanted to play it some more. So I've literally not played most of the game. That, I think that's what he says. But it also doesn't mean that I found everything. At every level. Like, I didn't even find everything in the first level the first time I played. That was the first time I found everything. Alright. I don't need you. Did he? Well, there was another clue I was going to give on what game I was playing. Because uh, Grant Kirkhope also said this was the the most fun he ever had making stuff for a game. And I think if I would have given that quote, everybody would have known what it was. Kazooie's a girl. Something circus. Ripper. Grunty and the Broomstick Boys. Okay, I probably shouldn't be here yet. But I got everything all fixed, so I can come back here whenever. Oh yes, it's made by Rare, who made Donkey Kong Country, so yeah. See, here's the level, but you actually have to go find it. <clears throat> this one I know I didn't get everything when I played it last night. question I have is, is there a transformation house in here?
Like, I didn't figure out what to do with that crab right there. Okay. I like this guy. First, I'm gonna take all his stuff. I'm not going to do that yet, though. Oh, hi. Ow. It's a crying hippo. Lover. God, because he was so mean. Hippo who can't swim. The rare as we used to know it is dead. Alright, so you'll get to hear the sound that I was talking about before, Green Fuzz. It's, it's awful. <laughs> uh, excuse me, I would like those notes, please. Thank you. every time I hear it. So, yes, the Ernest. So what happened to Rare is that Nintendo decided not to renew their contract with them. Um, they didn't decide to renew their contract after they finished working on Jet Force Gemini. So, Microsoft bought them. And everybody was really pissed, but then they started making not great games because a lot of people from Rare were not happy about it either, and they left. So the first thing they made, I believe, was uh, Grab by the Ghoulies, which was not great. And then they made Cameo, which was pretty good, and I might actually stream that at some point. And then they made Perfect Dark Zero. Well, did they make Perfect Dark Zero? I don't remember. It was them or somebody else. But then they made some pretty bad stuff, and... Yeah, Viva Pinata, um, Connect Sports. But basically nobody from the Rare that made this game exists in with the company anymore me treasure Yeah, so basically, it's only rare in name now. Alright, we're gonna fly. Flying is really weird in this game.
Yep, Retro Studios did have some uh, rare employees for the f first Metroid Prime. Well, I mean, how much is a gold is a gold puzzle piece going to cost or be worth compared to actual gold bars? Oh, I can't come up here yet. I forgot. Let's get out of here. I'll come back. Snacker. Yeah, you stay over there. So, if you get in the water in this level, excuse me, Snacker comes out. And if he... F if he gets to you, you take damage. Yep, I know. As long as you're on a box, he can't get you. I'm gonna go back. He doesn't need any of the eggs. It's just fine. Oh, I can actually go there. I haven't gotten that one yet, so... Let's go this way. So these are fun. What even? Oh, you did. Dang it. Alright, so... Let me see if I can get this. Oh, I can get it by climbing. Never mind. I'll come back for that. I didn't get this last time because I thought it was kind of difficult to do. And it's really not. I just got to pay attention. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of stuff that could be taken out of context in this game. There we go. doing a back front flip. It's amusing. Oh, I bet it is. I'll take two of those. Thank you. Alright. Okay, so this I never figured out how to do when I was playing yesterday. Where are you? I don't care. That's not what I'm talking about. Great. So is that why you like Banjo Tooie more than this one? Oh god, I hate that sound. Oh, 
Okay, so this down here... I knew what I had to do. Now, how do I do it? Do I just... Oh, I think I know how. Hold up, hold up. Like that? I have to work. Oh, okay. I don't know if it's sensitive hearing, but holy crap, that sound. It's really loud for me. It's not as loud for you guys. Tomato, okay. How's it going, by the way? Yeah, I found a bucket. I didn't help him when I was playing yesterday, so I didn't know what to get him. He said find him a pebble, I think. Yeah, that guy over there. Really? Is that it? Okay. Reach new heights in my shock jump spring. <laughs> the legs are tired. <sighs> yeah, I learned everything. So you can double jump off of these. That's a double jump. Okay. Well, it's only double jump if I go that way. So let's go here. There we go. Yeah, she didn't comment on it, um, but there's something else that gets said later that Banjo will accidentally say. <laughs> Alright, so I got that all done. So he's over here. All right, let me go talk to him. You know, actually, when I was playing this level last night, I did think that a pebble would be a blue stone, but I'm like, no, they wouldn't do that again. Me, Viki, no good for water. Can bear block hole with pebble? Do I have to poop it in there? Dang it. I did.
Dang, right, I'm doing it the hard way. When do I ever do stuff the easy way? Hey, pooping is a normal, everyday function. Alright. Furball. Conker's Bad Fur Day is a fun game. I don't know if it still holds up. But it was a fun game back in its day. I'll take that. Conker's Bad Fur Day was a... It was a three-action adventure game that was full of pop culture references. And a lot of the levels and stuff that you did were based on movies or TV shows or something. Okay, blue guy's over here, right? Take that damage, I don't care. I would love to see Conquer in Smash 2, but he's not as well known for Nintendo people, I guess. Even though that's where he started. Alright, now we can go to the other side of the island. I do, Lance. up here. Yeah, Conquer is not as influential. Follow the clues if you're looking for gold. I do not care about that. Ow. So, how, do you... Okay, let me try something. Because I didn't do this before. Not that button. Hmm. Okay. Oh!
Okay, that's how you do that. Yeah, Metroid... Metroid Fusion is not even close to Collectathon. Those are actual useful things. This is literally collecting stuff just to collect it. Well, maybe the hippo's not that smart. How about that? Maybe go this way? Yes, it was Blubber. That was his name, Captain Blubber. Ha! Ah, you'll never find me! It's so hard to find this guy. I don't know where he could possibly be. Gee, I wonder what that is. Oh no, not this. Please open me gently. Uh huh. I'll get right on that. six months to get everything? Man, it took me like two weeks maybe, if that, a week. I think I'd actually like to stream that again. Because when I streamed it the first time, I didn't have any sound I could really hear. guy down there I don't care about right now. Yeah, that's what I meant too. I got all 999 in like a week or two. proper thank you once I get done with the stream because I don't check discord when I'm in uh, doing a stream unless a mod like is oh my god you gotta check it get up there Ooh, I'm so afraid of you okay Weirdest hitboxes ever. <laughs> that is true. How was that? Uh... I'm trying to figure out. Hold on. Let me calibrate Hogbot here. That's weird. Shouldn't have done that. That doesn't want to do what I want. Tell it. Whatever, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, I only saw three. He's calibrated for more than three. 
And yes, I know you can run up here with uh, Kazooie, but I don't want to. Oh, and that's where some of the camera angles mess up. nice to know. Gold feathers are... I've gotten them before. Um, you don't get them until the third level. I'm not going to say what they are yet, but... over here. Since I'm over here, I can go back to the ship. Okay, so why does first person view? I'm gonna get that. Get those. Yeah, I had no clue what to do with the hermit crab. I was shooting him with eggs, but he said eggs were useless. I tried to ground pound him from above, and it didn't do anything. Peck his face. Okay. I didn't think I could get close while he was, you know, clawing at me. Oh, I still need to go over there, too. They are big boxes. Okay, I know where else I have to go to after I deal with this crab. <laughs> what? <laughs> what just happened there? Beach, you find nothing without Nipper's help. Yeah, she really helps situations, let me tell you. So why did he stop? Before he didn't stop. Oh my god. No, 
All right, fine. Let's go get some health. Oh, there's one. You might have? I don't know. Yay, a knockout nipper. Got an achievement for it, too. Oh, jeez. You even paying attention. There we go. That's kind of scary. think she would have said something, but she didn't. She's very inconsistent with her, uh, talking. Unlike Laylee, who just blurts everything at everyone. He's not- he wasn't an easy boss. Excuse me? Because you can't- you don't have spatial, uh, or depth perception there to find out where you gotta hit him. Alright, one last place to go, and I think I'll have everything. Entirely possible. Gamer picture. I didn't do anything for the weekend. Okay, so that's outside of the level. Uh, I didn't do that when I played last time. I can't fly, can't I? Okay. So yeah, it's weird. You would think that this would be signaling that it's a different area. So you can't go into it. Salty Hippo. 
but you can fly up there. I missed. Yep. I really hate that. I didn't want to go that high, and he went that high. Ugh! Oh, yeah, just keep falling. It's cool. Whatever. Are you serious? There you go. Oh, I know you can adjust the camera, but it's a pain in the ass to do. Alright, let's do this again. There you go. I like how Banjo just sits there, literally like a stuffed bear. Like, okay, here we go. And no, no, you cannot adjust the camera, other than put it behind you. Let's <coughs> bring it the back off the lighthouse. Okay, I'm gonna try that. Just because I'm tired of flying. But it still showed off that you can indeed fly up here if necessary. Oh, there's a spring. Three national parks, huh? Interesting. Okay. Music notes, one puzzle, one honeycomb. What am I missing? that one. Ah! I did get the honeycomb in the ocean. That one over there. Take a little fly, I think. I broke it. <laughs> I'm actually going to go fly, so then I will explore. Yes, Lance, I am going to Pack South in January. point of PAX is to, uh, it's basically 
a place. It's kind of a fundraiser, but also a convention of video game, the video game industry, run by the guys who uh, do the the comic strip Penny Arcade, hence the name Penny Arcade Expo. There's, I think, four Penny Arcades Expos. Um, one is PAX Prime, which is in Seattle. There's one in Boston. It's PAX East. And then there's PAX South, which is in San Antonio, Texas. And then there's one in Australia, I think. You know what? I'm not going to fly. Still a free guy I don't care about. Uh, yes, going to conventions, you can get sick. There is an actual real thing that people talk about. It's basically getting the flu. Okay, nothing over there. Nothing over there. I already went there. shark. Oh, I guess I'm swimming. Ha! Ah, not today. You mean this? I already went over here. I actually already did this. God dang it. Why are you- mm, Why are you underwater, stupid? I didn't tell you to go underwater. There. Go away. But I'm doing all this so I can show that I actually did this. I'm doing alright. I did all this already. Might be underwater. Oh, great. Just what I need. <laughs> There's an egg. <laughs> That's probably the one that I lost from the top of the mountain. Hiding under a box or something stupid. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay. There's a puzzle piece. So I'm still missing two, two notes and the one honeycomb. Oh, I see that over there at least. Okay. I got everything here, right? Yeah. Okay. Get flying. I remember this one. I didn't get it when I was playing last time. There we go. The tokens? Uh... They're not? I thought they were, they just looked horrible. Yeah, those are sprites. I'm missing two music notes. And you know what? I don't think I'm too worried about those music notes. You cannot grab ledges, no. Alright, we're gonna get out of this level. Chest by the pillars, I thought I got those. I'm pretty sure I got everything in there. So I shot it over there. Then come over here. eventually go for 100%. I'm not going for 100% now. Hey, 
Where are you going that way? Click clock wood. That's a lot of pieces missing. I'm not going to talk to you yet. My first actual playthrough, I'm not going to go for 100 until after I beat the game, as long as it lets me. this yet. <coughs> oh yeah, that link also. Um, I did just update my merchandise in there. It is cheaper because now I can actually set my profit margins. Um, and at most, I set it so that I make a dollar off of things, so... There's some shirts, there's coffee mugs, other stuff there. Still think the prices are a little bit steep for a couple things, but the shirts are actually decent now. Oh, I already talked to you, I don't care. You're useless. Uh, to make your own merch. It's not super hard. To make stuff people want, it's probably not that easy. Well, I don't make- I don't spend any money to make it. I just make it, and then once they- Once they uh, make it themselves, then I get whatever I put for my profit. Bubba Goof Swamp. This was a fun area that I played in. This was the last area I really played in yesterday. How much did I play? I only played for a couple hours. So it's not like I played, like, everything. I literally only played a couple hours. Oh, I didn't even see that guy there. Retracting your jiggies, I... I don't know. Maybe you want to save them to open up another level. I don't know. Like, if I want to save up all of my things after this to get the... I probably actually could have opened up that other level. Alright, now I can go into the next level. Yeah, 
It is? Oh well. Whatever. This is where I went third yesterday, and this is where I'm going third now. Hey there. My favorite sport is loogie flicking. Cauldron College. Eating a bucket of beans. Oh, there's a gold feather. I'm going to go and say right now I'm not jumping in the water. Oh, what the heck, I'm jumping in the water. I'll go do it over here. Ow, ow, ow. Piranha water, keep your smelly feet out. That's exactly what she wants. It is, it's, uh, Banjo's sister. Yeah, this level, I really like this level. New move. Really hard to find a new move here. Hi there, frog. These are the waiting boots. Chicken legs, wear some. Okay, chicken or er, Kazooie. <laughs> Let's go grab a pair. Yeah, she uh, she ignores that one. Well, it's not powered on yet, that's why. Okay, I don't know what this thing is. I didn't try this, though. Oh! Yummy! Croc disliked that. Oh! Great! Yeah, I didn't do that when I played yesterday, so I didn't get everything. Okay, I got all those already. I don't care. Ow. I'm not going to use the waiting boots yet. I'm going to do everything I can do without the boots. Oh, God. <laughs> Yellow feather. Invulnerability feather. Bottles will tell you more. I'm going to collect this one. Plenty of time for this. This one is actually easy in, in this level. There's one later in this level that is not as easy. It actually made me a little salty when I was playing yes last night. Because the camera angles fight against you. Oh, 
that's what that platform is for. <laughs> Today I learned. Go this way. Eggs and those, I don't care. <laughs> I like to live dangerously. Well, that's not what I wanted. You weren't supposed to double jump instantly. So, this is an interesting little thing here. This is on 360 arcade, uh, live arcade. Oh, they they improved on it. Um, this originally came on the Nintendo 64. They improved on this though. They added some stuff, some quality of life improvements. So, and this actually looks better than it did on the, if I would stream from a 60, Nintendo 64. Oh my God, jump! Thank you. This is what they let me do. Actually playing it on my Xbox One through Game Pass. This is actually on Game Pass, so basically you can play it anytime. Egg, give me egg. All three Banjo games are on Game Pass. But I've been told the third one is not good. All right, this way. Ugly, hairy trespasser. Really? Okay. One. Give me this. Here. Uh, nuts and bolts. That was the Xbox 360 one. Yep, that's what it's called. Okay, coming over here is actually kind of... No, it's not kind of useless. her hat. Oh, 
I'm so not making it. Come on, get up. Get up. There you go. I don't like that you can't see where the next one really is. So the next one is here. Right? No. There. <laughs> yeah, that is true. There is that one portable one. Hi there. This one is a little annoying to get. There we go. Sausage and pancake on a stick. Okay. Alright, so now we got that done. We will come back here later. I like this music so far. This is my favorite music that I've heard in the game. in a blanket. That's something else you could be eating actually right now, Pretzel. My feet are so numb and cold. So do something about it. Oh, hey, thanks to the sub there, Minion. I don't know when that happened, but I see it. <laughs> it sounds so painful. Now. Oh, okay. Tank top. I would love that. I'd also like to be swallowed. Because that makes sense. All of this makes sense, this part. You die here? What? How does one die here? Oh, look at that camera angle switch. Red, purple, light blue. I guess that's pink. Nope. 
It was yellow. Huh? Okay. I just didn't pay attention. Like blue, pink, it was yellow, then red. Okay. I know. Poor Professor Surrenders. What's up, Ernie, by the way? Blue, pink. Purple. Red. Ah! Oh my god, hit him. Which one was it? This one? Oh yeah, Kazooie's not a nice person. Alright. Yes, I do know. Alright, so that is done. Uh, let me get some of this over here. Great. I think I take Conquer in that fight still, because Kazooie still needs Banjo, so... Alright, let's go see this thing. Oh, there he is. Okay. Banjo versus Conker would be different. Does Banjo or does Conker get his weapons? <laughs> yeah, you're dead. Ah, he's over there. can heal himself, huh? Yay! Hey. Okay, so I have no reason to come back over here unless I want the feathers. I want the feathers. <laughs> Alright, let's go over here. So how am I doing? Four 
four more jiggies, 32 more notes, and two honeycombs. There's a honeycomb around here, isn't there? Is there? Okay. Um. All right, we're gonna do this first. This one is my most hated one. Because of the freaking camera angles. Well, the piranhas bite at him. And so you eventually just run out. That's what I think about it. Okay. Let's keep going. Oh, really? Yeah, that wasn't funny, was it? Saw something here. There we go. Now we get a fun transformation. I get to be a crocodile. You actually get to attack things. See, look, and his his shorts are on the correct way, <laughs> unlike the bug where it's bad, they're backwards. <laughs> so he can go through tiny places, but also he can walk around in the water. Well, Kazooie is the bird, Banjo is the bear. How's it going, shellfish? You can just spam the button and just fight all day. Uh, the happy thing was the the waiting boots. Hey, guess what? You can go into Nostril. And there's things here. This is the minigame I do not like. Yes, you do. Because he does that. It's not like I need it, so who cares? This minigame sucks. Because it's it's a lot of RNG. I don't know what the shoes are for. So I gotta eat the red ones first.
There's a trick that you can kind of win easily with this one. Just go where he's going, and as long as you get there first, he can't eat anything. I mean, he'll turn kind of quick if he finds one closer, but you can get a couple before he does this way. Oh, I got an achievement. Mine. Mine. See? <laughs> it's like, no, you're not getting any. You only win easy game. Now you play a harder game. Eat reds, avoid yellows. Alright, so there's gonna be yellow ones and red ones. Don't eat the yellow ones. Those. This is where it starts RNG. And if they don't show up near you, it's a problem. YouTube was doing that to me yesterday when I was watching somebody. It made me sign in once. Okay, so now it's going to switch between what I can eat and what I can't eat. I can eat red ones. Yellow! Ah! Let's hate that one. Come on, switch, switch. Thank you. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Switch, switch, switch. Whoo! Yeah, Stanley dying was sad. It's no. Nope, not doing it. I will slide off like a slug. Uh huh. <laughs> yep, I'm screwing off with the one thing I came in here for. So see you later. <laughs> okay, now I can go have fun as an alligator. Though I still gotta do that over there. Alligator, crocodile, whatever, it's a thing. Oh look, they're gone. Ah, there it is. Okay. I can't get to it, but there it is. Yes. Yes, it is. Alright, now I can come over here and collect a whole lot of stuff.
I can eat you. Come here, you stupid dragonfly. Ah! Got all the notes. Well, that's good that you're actually enjoying it. Alright, so I think I am done with the alligator, crocodile, whatever the heck he is. Um, oh, I can get this over here. Hold on. Oh, no, I gotta get that over there. Alrighty. Well, it's technically, I guess, in this world because you jump into the world to get to it. Whee! Uh, where's he at? Gator's over here. that maze again. Well, basically the same thing, man. My childhood was all Nintendo and Sega. I've never been to a GDQ, no. So, when I did do this last night, I came out here, went down this pipe, and there was an ice level. I don't know if we'll have another Xbox, who knows. If anything, it might be, uh, I don't even know. Can't go through here, Sam. Xbox One was kind of a dumb name. Alright, so I can't go much further. Do I need this? No. I don't need this. Let's go.
entertainment center, huh? Okay. Though, okay, you can get back in that pipe. There's waiting boots out here, so... Not too big of a deal, but I want to go back in here. Crap, I gotta do all those again. Ah! Dang it. Alright. Does it play DVDs? That's weird. Um, oh, it's over here. Go. Well, I guess while I'm over here. Am I gonna have to do this all over again? Well, I mean, I'll have to do this all over again, obviously. wanted to play it and I was looking for something on the game pass that I could stream that people would actually want to watch for sure okay good I don't have to do this again and I thought hey why not this nice Okay, so I'm probably gonna get a puzzle piece from the alligators. I don't know where the other honeycomb is. Not turtle abuse, he said his, his feet... Oh, why did I do that? I don't care. His feet were cold and something else. So I helped him. Okay, now over there. That is over there. Do you know what a cattail is? It's the thing that... It's the tree-like things in here. And they look like that in real life and can get pretty tall. Really? I did not know that. <coughs> Alright. Oh, uh, next one was over here. No, not over there. Over here. There 
this. What? <laughs> yeah, that's why you're dead. <laughs> yes, they are. You probably deserved it, though. So this thing is what he's talking about. Oh, nailed him! This is where the guy was at. Hey, Dark Lake, what's up? Still dealing with the uh, gators here. Ah. Hey. This is my first time actually playing through a Banjo game, so... Pretty much after this level, it's going to be a blind playthrough. I'm even finding things now that I didn't find before. Alright, um... So you said a dandelion. Or, I mean, a cattail. I know... There's a couple... That I haven't messed with. Flipping to get it, okay. Well, there is this one. This had stuff on it, though. Well, this is a whole lot of nothing. Combs, yeah, the filled ones refill your health. The empty ones, if you collect six of them, you get another health honeycomb on your health bar. Hmm. 
it's not helping. There's a free guy. I already got what was in there. Well, let's go on top of there anyway. You remember correctly now, okay? Is it going to be in his hut? Where am I going, by the way? Gator. Where is he? Over here. Where there was something there, but I guess not. Ha! Ah. Here comes the long run. Feather, don't care. Okay. Let's go see what you have to say. Hey, Kevin, what's up? Ow. Oh, well, he had that back there. Wow, what is that all about up there? There's no fire here. Really? Okay. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. Can't get it that way? That's fine. Really? Oh, that's stupid. And it wasn't I'm not even playing this because of that, either. I just decided, hey, I'm gonna play this now. Okay. Oh, thank you. Yay! I'm gonna go collect everything else up there. That's everything in here.
worth. Uh, okay, so the red feathers I use while flying. Um, it takes one red feather to elevate myself. Eventually they will be used for something else too, I think. I'm not sure. The gold feathers are invulnerability. I'm supposed to go talk to the mole to find out what, how to use them. Let me go talk to him now, actually. What about- okay, whatever. Alright. Boots last forever. That's what I was going to do. Well, he was talking when I turned into an alligator or crocodile. It was a joke. Yay. I did need a croc there, didn't I? You are not a hog, Grunty. <laughs> that timing. Fine, I'll go be a croc again. There are some things that they changed in this. I couldn't tell you everything, but there are changes. See, you can't. Green Fuzz was saying that you would skip the animation for that if you did the uh, trot, and you do not. It still does the animation. for being here tonight. <laughs> that would suck if I lost notes when I died. 
I died once when I played last night to see how I'd like this. And I was trying to get the 10 second uh, puzzle piece in here. Because I fell off and then I couldn't get out in time. And the camera angle just screwed me completely. Oh, you can only carry 10 of those. Okay. This is the third... Well, this is the third level I've been in. This level is open once I find it. Eh. It's a book. Oh, the spell book. You have found the magic sheets I have for you. Simple brain, what'd you say? I'm not give my spells away. <laughs> Blue eggs on sandcastle floor in treasure trove world. Okay, so if I go back to the treasure place and I put that in on the floor of the castle, I'll get something. But do I want to use cheat codes? It gave me blue eggs. I haven't had a problem with eggs either, so... Okay, so this... Oh, she's gonna tell me stuff. In a dumpster where she sleeps. Stupid quest. Oh, shit, stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 thank you. The only thing she's ever won was a sweatiest socks competition. She often boasts of appearing on the cover of Fat Hag Monthly, polishing her crystal ball. Well then, I'm gonna go use it to see what it does. Since we are both- we are all unsure what it does. over here. Uh, 
Um, if it's the same as ukulele, they're gonna give me a quiz later that I have to get them correct. Why am I over here? You only have to memorize the, the shaking words. Well, that's why you go back and talk to her. Talk to her all again. Get all that information. And then go do endgame. Yes, I know. Yeah, I do remember. Uh, they did give me different answers when I was playing last night. Alright. Okay, I gotta do that again. You lost your gold again? Well, I'm not getting it back. I didn't like doing it. That was too easy. In a chest? Okay. I won't say who that actually is, but okay, thanks. I don't know. How did you get switched to that? Go away. Oh, wrong button. Really? Ah, 200 eggs. Nice. That lousy cheat for extra eggs. Out there and chicken legs. All right. In a chest. Okay, I'll go look. I swear I jumped in all the chests. the wrong button. I want to attack with B for some reason. Really? You didn't close? Okay. Okay. There's feathers in here. I'm not going to use actual cheat codes. I'm going to use the ones they give in the game, like that, if it's going to improve something. <gasps> oh my god, that camera angle. Don't do that again, game. But all right, this I swear I got this. This is too, yeah, it's not in there. Well, yeah, that's the ones I'll use the, the enhancements, not the actual sheets.
How about you? What did you have? You have eggs. Okay, so I found... Where the heck can I be missing two? Did I miss anything while swimming? In the crab? I thought I got everything in the crab. Let's find out. Okay, not in here. I'll check the boat now. Okay, well you were useless. That's what it did. Okay, so that's the... That's that. That's the other one. Oh my god, that sound. Oh. And it's not in here because it looks like I got everything. area I already helped you once stop crying lighthouse area let's go look again I could see him pretty easily if it was underwater Because this actually has decent draw distance.
Exactly. I wonder if it is up there. Alright, we're gonna find out. One second. Keep hearing things happen here. Uh. Okay. Uh, for those that don't know, tomorrow I am hosting a race of 20XX. With myself, Corey from CC Gaming, Nintendo Addict, and Zero the Hammer Slayer. We're gonna see who can race in a random seed that I generate right before we start. And since it's completely random, I don't know what's gonna happen. They don't know what's gonna happen. It's gonna be fun. There's nothing up here. Wonder if I could see it. That's a one up over there. Twenty XX. It's a, it's a uh, it's a Mega Man X um, Metroidvania type game, roguelite. And also, with this race, uh, viewers can also join in because I will give the seed number. So, if you would like to see if you could beat whoever's time finishes it, if we finish it, because I don't know how well it's going to go. Okay, I can't see this. I have one idea of where it could be. Well, I mean, it's, uh, it goes on sale a lot, actually. On Steam, it's on, on Switch now. I don't know if it's on any other systems. Okay, so it's not here. I am looking for music notes. Music notes are basically red coins, and there's a hundred of them at every stage. I already got the ones in there. Actually, no, you still do ground pound. You take damage. 
if you ground pound off a ledge. I, uh, I experimented with this last night. Okay, I'm so not worrying about this. Let's go find this fourth level. I don't think it's here. So 20XX is a roguelite uh, Men uh, Mega Man X type game. <clears throat> Basically the levels are made procedurally. Um, the bosses, they all have weaknesses just like a Mega Man boss would. And if as you fight the bosses, the further along that you go, um, what's in here? The further along you go, the more moves they get, so they get more difficult. Oh, right. That was this. I don't need this. Rawr. It happened to me last night where it was completely it was completely logging me out but I logged back in once and it was fine afterwards And that's how you get that one. some waiting boots in here.
Hey, just because Banjo is not smart doesn't mean you have to say that. Uh, okay. I never went in this room before. I've never said that you laugh like Banjo. Oh my god. What is up with that? Sand eels. Best friend at which school <coughs> was the awful Fatty Hattie. Actually, she usually reads Big Butts and Guts magazine. A sip in a glass of her favorite smoothie elephant sweat. Yeah. Uh, what was the point of coming here? That's it? There gotta be another reason. That's probably a level I gotta open up. in there. That's where I came up. Went in there. Alright, let's go in here. <coughs> yeah, it does sound like you. Okay, so we got spider webs now. Fifty. Oh, there's a cauldron in there. Let's <laughs> go to spider pancakes for breakfast. She usually has dog dung burgers. Yum. Wart bags and finishes with rat sorbet. Mmm. Good stuff. Okay, so I can't really go in there. What does this take? 350. Okay. How many do I have? 298. No? Bad. Alright, there is the next area. <laughs> Alright, so I think that's gonna do it for now. Thanks everyone for watching, I do appreciate it. I will be playing more of this. But for now, let's see here. How about do a raid? Let's see, who do we got? If you have not liked your sub, please do so. If you haven't joined Discord, join that Discord. 
Hey, Joe, you are... <laughs> you're just in time to join the raid. All right. Hmm, well... <laughs> well, we've got four options. We're gonna go raid the one person who's working on the thing for tomorrow. So, let's go raid Nintendo at it. Make sure to put the hashtag in the chat that's up there. Here's the link to his stream. Thanks everyone for watching, and I will see you later. Bye!